Hi, I'm Marie Liberati, Gourmand World award-winning author of the cookbook series and blog, The Basic Art of Italian Cooking. I'm excited to be sharing some recipes with you today. I have some recipes that actually have a story to them. What recipes will I be sharing and what stories do they have? I'm making a baked sockeye salmon crepe with bechamel sauce. The story, I'm using a sockeye salmon from Wild for Salmon which is a company that is fisherman owned and focuses on sustainably harvested Alaskan sockeye salmon and seafood, wild caught in Bristol Bay, Alaska. First, we're making the bechamel sauce. I put the butter in the saucepan and melted it. Then I added in the flour and whisk in the milk a little bit at a time till it thickens. And it's just about ready. I'm going to add in my pinches of nutmeg. I'll add two pinches of nutmeg, just small pinches, and whisk a little bit more so I get that nutmeg mixed in and we're just about done. Now it's time for the star of the show. Alaskan sockeye salmon, wild caught and from wild for salmon. Now it's really important for your health and taste as well to only use wild caught Alaskan sockeye salmon. So let's get back to cooking. Heat a tablespoon of olive oil in the saute pan, place the salmon in skin side down, sear the salmon until it's pink and flaky. And once it's cooked, you're going to transfer it in a bowl, just like I did here, and flake it. It should still be a little warm, so it will blend easier with the roviola cheese. So what I'm gonna do is I'm placing it in a bowl with this roviola cheese, which again is a semi-soft cheese that it's an artisan cheese made in Italy. So I'm going to cut some more and blend a little bit at a time with my flake salad. And again, the salmon should be warm, so it blends easily with the raviola cheese. And now sprinkle in some chopped parsley, finely chopped. You're gonna mix all that in, blend it in, and you'll see it's really blending in with the warm salmon now. Okay, and now it's on to filling our crepe. First, we're gonna preheat the oven to 375 degrees. Next, we're going to cover the bottom of our casserole dish with some of that yummy bechamel sauce that we made. So we're making like a little bed for your crepe. I'm gonna put some of that filling right in the middle of the crepe. Now this is a rich filling, so you don't wanna really put too much filling in each crepe. Just about a tablespoon is really plenty. And what you're gonna do is fold the crepe in half and then fold in half again and put it in your bechamel sauce. And then we're going to cover the crepe with bechamel sauce again. And sprinkle some, I have a combination of shaved and grated Parmigiano Reggiano. You're gonna sprinkle that on top and we're ready to bake. Bake this in the 375 degree oven for about a half hour or until it's golden and bubbly on top. And here we have it, baked salmon crepes with bechamel sauce using wild for salmon, sockeye salmon that's wild caught from Bristol Bay, Alaska. I'm Chef Maria Liberati. Please join me for more great dishes using wild for salmon like fettuccine with a limoncello salmon ragu and a baked ricotta sockeye salmon strudel. See you next time.